<laughs> what up guys it's Ashania and I'm here with another video y'all are gonna see me get ready for my black history mom slash African awareness headshot photo shoot I've already done my hair and my edges I have never done these before I was just trying something and my my edges on both sides never look the same I tried a look last night I'm actually gonna Im insert the picture here and like I like that, but let's see if I can actually recreate that. I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows and my foundation off camera. And you guys have seen me do this before, so if you haven't, go watch the other GRWM. In case you're wondering what that means, it's get ready with me because everyone doesn't exactly know what it means. So, I'm using this uh, pretty head wrap thingy here, as you would have seen in the picture. So just stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe and click on that notification bell so you don't miss anything. This is actually day 19 of the eyelashes. I do have one single bottom lash there. Lonely, lonely, lonely. And on this eye, yeah, we already established that there was actually none. But yeah. So here we go with the head wrap. I'm gonna, this is not a how to wrap, but African head wrap or whatever because I just put this ish on my head and just start wrapping it around in circles. So there's no how to, no whatever. I just stick it and do something with it. It's a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Let me see if I can actually get, like, I can't even get the whole thing in the camera. That's how much cloth it is. But it's not even square or anything. So I take the rectangular piece. This cloth has two different sides. It has a side that has um, shimmery and then there's plain. I like the shimmery side, plus it goes better with my dark skin. I just take it and make it like a peak. And then, yeah. I'm gonna attempt to do that thing again last night. Tilt my head down, put it on. I don't even know if you guys can see, but I'm hoping you can. And then I take these two pieces and tie. What is this look like? This look like a bunch of crap on my head. What? <laughs> After I tight, tight a little tighter. Okay. Let's see what I'm gonna do with all this extra cloth here. I'm gonna turn all of it to the pretty side. Make sure that all the pretty side is right around the cloth. And then keep rolling it. Wait, I roll it the other direction. And then just find some place to tuck it. I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna roll this side so that I can have a place to tuck it. Like I said guys, I have no idea what I'm doing. But I just... twirl around some cloth. So I'm thinking this is my head wrap for today. For a head shoe, I'm not sure what color lips that I should use, but I just go freehand. I would have bought this MAC palette, not palette, but it has a whole bunch of lip glosses in it. Thinking to go dark, but I wanna ombre it a bit. This is one of the ones that I would have bought in Miami when I went into the Mac store and spent so much money. Mac store, Mac store. I'm gonna start off with like a kind of nude color. Don't worry, guys. I know when I have big lips, I can't ever wear lips like this. That's why I wear darker color on the outside to make it ombre. Cause this color is never me. Like I look like if I'm parched, like I'm hungry. Like you know, like you have had nothing to drink for like 500 days. But yeah, and then I'm gonna take this darker color. I'm put on the outside. Oh. 
Okay, now I'm gonna also take my Night Moth by MAC that I would've also bought and outline my lips. Next, I'm going to take my 88 color palette by BH Cosmetics and I don't even know what color to put on my eyes guys but like I said I'm just one on the go person so I'm gonna put these earth tone colors over here basically we'll come back when I'm actually fully completed Okay, so now I'm gonna take my felt tip eyeliner that I would have gotten from Sephora for my birthday because that's this is the birthday one of the birthday gifts that I actually picked up and just do a little wing. Now to match the head wrap, I have like a glitter wand and I'm thinking I can put some on my eyes just to brighten it up. Now I'm going to attempt to put a white line right down my lip. I don't know how I'm going to get that done, but I'm thinking to put gloss on my lips and like coming right down where I want it. So that it sticks on. Let's see how that goes. I think I need a brush for this. Give me a second. Back. Okay, let's try it with a brush. It's not working, guys. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to try this with the concealer and see what goes on. Guys, I think I just messed my whole lips up, like really bad okay let's rub these off and try again okay so i quickly redid the lip and i'm trying it with the lip gloss itself i think i'm just gonna leave it as a damp ombre lip guys this is failing let's say okay so i cleaned up around the lipstick a little bit and i'm gonna go in with my matte waterproof mascara and do my bottom lashes gonna go in with some blush and some highlight now it's a photo shoot so I just went extra with the makeup but like I don't normally wear this much makeup guys so right now I'm using the blush artisan color baked blush is exactly what the name of it is um, yeah just go come through with those pink cheeks girl <laughs> okay Yeah, so it looks like someone just, you know, coughed in my face before I photo shoot. I'm gonna apply some Ruby Kiss All Over Glow. And just highlight. Highlight to the gods. <laughs> oh, shoot. That's how the beauty gurus be. Don't you see them? Oh my god, girl. Just highlight. Highlight to the gods. And I just be like, girl, do not kill me. So 
Now for the dots, I'm literally gonna use my same lip lipstick and just put the dots everywhere on my face. Here goes. I can try. Um, okay, this is pinkish. I guess it doesn't matter, right? I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna see if I go over that with these, with this, if it will actually work out. <sighs> Pray for me, guys. Okay. So I'm actually loving this, guys. Alright, so I'm gonna attempt to do the... Strokes downward I honestly really want to get this line on my lips okay so I think this is the finished look now I have to go for some earrings okay I'm actually loving the look guys I was not expecting to get it done but um you know everyone has their own opinions but I personally like it so yeah uh, so there's this big bangle I don't know if I can put my hand in the photo shoot or whatnot oh I'm wearing a dashiki kind of like thingy you know it's not really a dashiki but you know a dashiki like funny gonna be in a photo shoot it's just a headshot so this is not even gonna be here but I'm saying I'm African why not go full African and done you know what I mean so I have these earrings I have ooh, these earrings these are gorge um I have hoops I have the ones from the picture, which is these ones. Wait, you can't see the full thing. But I also have this necklace thingy. That would definitely look nice in pictures. I have silver, but silver is a no-no to be honest. I think gold looks better with this look. And I also have these gold dropping earrings. I'm gonna take these out now and show you what they Okay, so these are them. Uh, I prefer between these and these ones. I don't know which ones they like the best. Let's just put them in. Hmm. I think this one really gives me the African light -like look. This one is like if I'm going something formal. Let's see what the photographer thinks. Because it's for his portfolio. <laughs> I'm loving. I look like a real, 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 real African. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know me, right? Okay. <laughs> I'm just waiting on the photographer to come. Um, I'm not sure if he's going to want me in the vlog. I'll just ask before I do vlog, but uh, yeah, stay tuned for the pictures and everything because I'm actually going to insert the pictures in this vlog, so that will determine when this vlog actually gets up because I'm not sure when he's actually going to get around to editing, so <laughs> y'all, I'm loving it for shoot, guys. Okay, guys, so I'm actually on my way to the shoot, so stay tuned for when I actually get there. Okay, guys, so I've actually made it. I have on, um, you know, the tube top because it's like face shots. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay, so this is the tester. What do you mean? Up a little bit. Up my left.
Okay guys, so I actually completed. I actually was, you know, greased down here and stuff. I actually have to wipe it off because I'm actually going to sell some snow cones now. But yes, I can't wait to show you guys the pictures. They have to be edited and everything. But stay tuned for them. In one piece I'm actually gonna go sell some snow cones today I'm actually going looking like this I'm thinking to take you guys with me I don't know maybe maybe not but just in case I'll take the camera okay guys what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna vlog when the little kids have African day for you so that you can actually see them in their pretty um, African wear but yes I'm still rocking mine there is looking a little greasy but you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but you know what I'm saying this is mommy in her African wear. Hello! Her dashiki light looking thingy. Here we go! And some of the kitties in their wear. African wear, mom. Hi, Ajaray! I didn't see you. African wear! Say hi! Some more African wear. Say hi. Yes, you will be Avengers with the Shania. <laughs> Say hi. That girl to Risi around. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> the African wear man. I want some No, do not kill me. <laughs> Say hi. Hi. <laughs> The Africa outfits, man. That she on the vlog, I didn't even know. Hello. Hello. Gotcha. 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 <laughs> Oh, 
kids just having fun. They look so happy. Lash it, man. Hands up, children. Hands up. This is mommy today in her African wear. Afternoon. <laughs> Juve morning. <laughs> Customer. So I've made it home in one piece. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Smash that like button. Subscribe or and comment. You can follow me on my social medias at Ashania. They're spelled the same way as the Ashania in my channel name. You can also follow me on Twitter at the same Oshania as I post all the videos right there as well as the Facebook of this channel which is Adventures with Oshania. Today's post notification shout outs go to MGS underscore Travis and Mr. Hartman 14. Thank you. Just keep watching my videos and commenting and you will receive your shout out. I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you again for watching this video and peace.